Hello guys and in this video I am going to show you about the Android Oreo boot animation which, which is a boot animation concept uh, This boot animation is made by the developers, it is a zip file and it is not flashable So you can, uh, so I will show you how to install this directly on your system folder and get the correct permissions and it won't result in a boot loop also first uh, Let's start, I will give you a preview about <laughs> the boot animation and I will start the phone and again go to recovery so here is the galaxy mega and you can do this on any phone yes uh, don't need any samsung phones or any so this is my old boot animation I have set ok so you can see this this is not the Oreo boot animation. I will flash the zip and show you. This was a preview of my old boot animation. So you can see the Android. Okay, the phone is booted. Yeah, that was quick, but the Oreo boot animation is very long. So that was my old animation. I will go and replace with the Oreo boot animation. So you will need a file explorer or am I explorer anything? Okay. So let's go to file manager. You have the CM30 file manager. You need nothing here. And here is the root folder. Yeah, we're going to the root folder. And we will go to system. And here is media. Here is the old boot animation and uh, delete selection or you can back up too if you want even if you are afraid uh, that it will get a root uh, it will get boot loop and <coughs> yeah or if you have taken backup then you can seriously like have some stunts now go to internal storage and you have this oreo boot animation so yeah i recommend to copy it on your internal storage uh, it may directly get into root so oh, sorry now it's a select here and go to root folder here is the uh, oh shit there was a system folder directly system and media now the media we have to copy this here so the operation is co co successfully completed now go here sorry click on this and go to properties uh okay first of all other uh, file managers cannot do this means directly select and go there and copy selection you need to go uh, select that copy and then go and paste okay so you can do this on other also others uh, okay so after the permissions you need to go owner group you need to read write okay and use the x1 you can do this Okay, but if you are so it is already selected please deselect this and now you go with it now go to themes if you selected any other wood animation and customize it with the original one so yeah as you can see here you got this boot animation here only so okay it's already there Okay, so I think the boot animation is successfully readable. So I will reboot now and you will see the boot animation flashed correctly. And if you are facing problems after reboot or during the reboot you may you may boot loop if you are on another device please take a backup of the full rom using twrp go to backup select all the options means check the boxes swipe to backup and oh first select the micro sd card and swipe to backup and so i won't give any guarantee but if anything happens wrong so as you can see this is the oreo boot animation i have flashed on my device this is really really very cool
yeah I love this animation so here was the Oreo boot animation and if you like this video and found this helpful and if you flash this and if you love this please press the like button here and there is a special thanks means you have to thank the developer for this so I have given the XDA link you need to go there and please press the thanks button on the post and yeah support the developer also and please like the like the uh, press the like button and subscribe for more videos i will be coming with more boot animation videos means the top five boot animations yeah the audio will be included in that so there will be zips and themes to the uh, cm13 themes and many things i will say about the boot animation so please stay tuned and subscribe